Welcome to the super secret spot. So, now that you're not blindfolded, I can just show you a wall of rocks. And in this wall of rocks, there's all kinds of things here. Is that one right there? So there is all kinds of stuff here in this wall of rocks at this super secret spot. What's interesting about this spot is that you're always looking at your feet. Most rock counters we're down here looking at our feet if we're just walking around. How often do you have to look up and up to look for rocks? Speaking of waking up, there's one right here. There it goes. So there's that one. And there's something here that looks interesting. But it's that's junk. There's quartzite. Don't need any more of that. So it's a challenge to look not only down at your feet but to be able to look up and there's a lot of up to look at so what happens when you are down in a hole in a super secret spot that's a little keeper huh even that little guy. So there's agates here of all sizes. From that small one there that we just I just showed you. All the way up to a, a couple pounders. But you know, for places like this here, The rude people will never get in and they'll get thrown out by the cops and probably cited. There are signs all over this place about security, no trespassing, but my buddy Jack was able to get us access here. And not only did he get access, he gets the key. So if you guys are always frustrated about not being able to go on private property, take the time and go talk to the property owner. Build that relationship, build the trust. Now this one here is a, I doubt if this owner will let anybody else in here because even after my buddy Jack has had friends, has, has been out here, I guess the owner has thrown other people off the property. So we are very careful off what we do. We don't do any damage. Heck, I've picked up all kinds of trash out of here and then hauled it out. And here in Oregon, since bottles are just 10 cents a piece now, those add up quickly. I need something for gas money to pay for my rock hounding fun. Well, I am here looking at a different spot. I think I see one right here. Yep, that's going to be a small one. And then, I'm up here and I see this. I don't know if you can see it, it's got almost like a light green to it. Wow. That's incredible. I wonder what the Mr. Jaws Jr. is going to think of this. Very cool. 
Well, more of the super secret spot. Sometimes you can sit here and scour an entire area that you'd think you'd find all kinds of stuff in. And you might find something interesting. That's a piece of petrified wood. But you keep looking, and you keep looking, and you keep looking. And then on occasion you'll reach down and you'll find something. And you know something, I looked at this area about three times already, and now I see something. Nice carnelian. There is a piece of uh, quartzite which can stay. So in this entire piece here, just off of the surface, I've only found two. Well, I'm back here. I'm looking at this thing here. I think I'm going to take that one just because of the color. <clears throat> and then there's a carnelian, a small one that just fell. There we go. See, just a small one. That'll get pocketed. But, the, but that one there, with that green in it, that's interesting. That's one that will probably get sliced, just out of curiosity. Hopefully I'll remember to get it wet and show you guys later. Well, everybody, we are getting close to wrapping it up. So, here is something here from the super secret spot. As you can tell, there's a lot of looking. But see, I can't show you around. I can just show you down to the rocks. But, hang tight. We'll show you everything that we found here today at the Jaws Junior Mobile Command Center. Hello everybody, we are back at the Mobile Command Center. But here's what we found today. Now, this pile is what Mrs. Jaws Jr. found. And this much smaller pile is what I found. And of course, she always finds more. She does very good at this. So we're going to take a look at some of hers. And yes, these are wet. Just sprayed them down so the colors could show through. And these are the ones that I got. Here's that one with the green on it that I showed you earlier. So not too bad for 
an afternoon's work, or a morning's work actually. So there you go everybody, it's been a fun day at our super secret spot. I want to give thanks to Jack who provided us access to this through his connection, the property owner, uh, was able to get the key and ha basically have unlimited access for the day there at this location. Um, fantastic place, uh, we're going to be definitely be coming back to it. And again, be very courteous to those property owners, some of them might actually let you on and there's going to be some that are not going to let you on. But for now, everybody, everyone's life is an adventure. Then there's mine with some cool rocks. This is the Adventures of Jaws Jr. Have a good one, everybody. See ya.